Friday tonight, it's Good Deeds. And a group has come up with a brilliant way of helping men with their mental health. What fictional family do you think you would fit into? So for me, just because my mother's maiden name, the Adams family. You're a fucking chubby answer. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Graham from The Shad Chef, and we started The Shad Chef Man Up in Blackburn. The Shad Chef Man Up is a men's mental health group where people can come and talk about the problems. Shadsworth Estate is on Blackburn. All the lads that run the man up grew up on this estate. About four years ago, we set up a page called the Shad Chef Council Estate Food Connoisseurs. I've always been bang into doing my council estate teas. It's like when I was a kid, my mum used to do my pot noodle and chips. I started doing these teas, I don't know why, but I was taking pictures and posting it. A couple of people slated it, but the majority of people loved it. Just went bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Since we started the pictures with the pot noodles and stuff like that, it's definitely gone in a different direction. We started doing sponsored walks, things like that, raising money for families who needed us at the time. So far, we've raised over £50,000 for local communities. <laughs> and then a friend of mine passed away last year. He decided to um, end his life by suicide. And that hit us hard. We didn't know how he was feeling. It just happened. We didn't know until it was too late. So we all got together and thought, oh, this is not right. Let's do something about it. So that's when me and a few other lads decided to start this man up. At first, we thought it weren't going to work, because the first week, two lads turned on. We thought, hey, hang on a minute, what's going on here? And then we got about, and we just went from strength to strength. Usually, I'll facilitate it, I'll ask the questions, I'll start off with my own answer. The first question, as always, how has your week been? Have you got anything to get off your chest? When I first started coming, I wasn't talking as much. I was a very quiet person. It's led to me reapplying for college, ignore what's happened before, move on with the future with these new skills they've given me. Confidentiality is key. What's said in the man of stays in the man of. I lost my job with COVID. I've gone a bit in myself, a bit. You know, a lot of people, men especially, they won't come to anything like this, will it? Because they think they're macho. We're changing that, aren't we? We've currently got a GoFundMe pay set up where people can donate if they'd like to, so we can keep the man up and running for the foreseeable future. If anyone else is setting up this kind of thing, what we do here, go for it, lads. Good to talk.